Hey, it's the homie Fast Cooper. You are now welcome to the crib. I'm going to need you to subscribe to the channel. Be sure to like and share this content for the boy, man. We're about to talk about Kanye to the aka Yeezy, aka Yay, aka Jesus. Walk Sky, show me the way because the devil trying to break me down. Jesus walks with me, with me. Now I'm in the corn industry. Woo! Your boy, yay, just, you know, disclosing information to the public that he's thinking about getting into the industry. Not thinking about it, he's actually getting into it, you know. Um, this is my opinion on the situation. Yay, you've been connected to Christianity for some time now, and you was doing the stuff with the choirs. Like, every Sunday, you was doing, like, some big mass performances, which were beautiful. And, you know, definitely were enlightening to people who feel like, you know, they don't really support, you know, uh, uh, religious music, right? Um, and for you to make a transition from that and get into the corn industry, it's just kind of troubling just to see. I think a lot of people are like confused just because they feel like you're against that and you're kind of against the, you know, quote unquote Illuminati and the people who are trying to control the, you know, industry and, you know, shadow ban so many artists and, you know, blacklist so many artists who do, who don't, uh, comply with their terms, including yourself. Right. But this is kind of the stuff that they get into, you know, the wicked stuff, right? And corn is, you know, the wicked stuff. That's like Hollywood, right? And for you to get into it, I know you could capitalize off it with your name and stuff like that, but you didn't have to use your name. You could have just played the back. You could have just got a facility, got an LLC, and, you know, got a little agency and, you know, didn't say anything about you being involved in it. You could have, you know, made sure it's NDAs involved. But you want to be the forefront of it. That's why it's just a little confusing. Now, the thing that's really going to be tough about the situation is the fact that you have a daughter who's of age. She's like, Northwest is like 12, 13, if I'm you know, not mistaken. So she's getting up there. So she's going to be going to school. She's going to be online. So things are going to actually hit, hit her uh, attention, right? But at the end of the day, you have to remember, even her mother was involved in the corn industry. So... At the age she is, and knowing that her mother, you know, ent entered stardom from the corn industry and her father profiting off the corn industry, it's going to be one of the things she may consider because it's going to be like a um, a family thing now. You know what I mean? Like, that's just going to be regular. It's going to be desensitized and it's going to be kind of like normal for y'all family. Like, y'all going to be able to talk about it. And openly and, you know, because you're going to have to warn your kid, you feel me? So I'm pretty sure her mother already spoke with her. And then you got other kids, there's other other ones that are going to look up to Northwest, you feel me? So I don't know, man. I feel like it's a little tough. It's definitely a bag in the corn industry. Um, You know, you just got to pay the actors and stuff like that, make cool scenes. But at the end of the day, man, I don't know if that's your lane, Kanye, you feel me? You should have just kind of played the background. Like, you ain't have to put that in the open. That's weird. You know what I mean? So that's going to make people think you're a little cuckoo, bro. You feel me? You were just getting people back with the Vultures album and the stuff that you were saying. But, you know, when you got caught in the airport and they interviewed you right in the airport and the stuff you were saying at the uh, private listening party for Vultures, like you, you've been winning the people. You know what I mean? Especially just how you tried to endorse Trump in the past. And, you know, we got everything going on with Joe Biden and people are wishing that Trump's back in office. This right here is going to kind of bring you back a couple steps. Not too much, but just enough to make people be like, what's up with this dude? You feel me? But hey, man, it's your life. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments about, you know, Mr. Ye getting into the corn industry. Is it corny? <laughs> the crib.